YouTube. Uh, I want to apologize. I didn't see these questions in time. I just stumbled upon them today. But I'll answer this one first, and then I'll answer that one. So this one says, how do you create holes along the web uh, or along the flange? Okay, now I took the time to create a beam already. Now you go on this custom connection. Of course, this palette is brought up by the advanced tool palette over there. And then go to custom connections and select bolts on beam. And this is bolts on place plate in case you want to do this on a plate, you use this one, but on the beam is this one. And then we're going to select the beam. Okay. Uh reference uh no. And unless you do, of course. And then our properties menu comes up. Now you can see these are bolts, but easily change them to holes by using the drop down menu and clicking holes. And uh <coughs> Uh, we can uh, change a few other things so uh, the layout will center them I guess and uh, number of bolts across two uh, intermediate distances just change that so you can see that they do change uh, number of bolts along we'll say three and then uh, start distance we'll say five inches from the edge okay and intermediate distance will say ah, four just to spread them out and you can stagger the, these distances by clicking which side you want to stagger and giving it a staggered distance of I don't know in my case I'll give it two okay and they stagger and you can change the position of the holes so you can put them in the lower flange or the web and that is how you put holes in the beam on the flange or the web and if you have any more questions please let me know i wish there was a thing i could remind me that someone's got a question on the channel there but i don't have that anyway uh that's uh that's it